Hi friends, in this video I will show you that how you can measure the power, the power of a AC circuit and AC circuit uh, you need to measure the voltage, currents and the power factor. So with these three quantities you can accurately check how much power is being used as an active power and the rest of amount of power is being used as a reactive power. So same thing um, I have done over here, I have used a voltage transformer and a current transformer to get the amounts and to convert it into a lower values and after that I have designed a two filter circuits over here which will basically filter our circuits and after that we this part is being will be used for uh, measuring the power factor and I will show you that how we will measure the power factor so let's run the simulation and check the results I have um, provided over here 220 volts AC and uh, I have provided here um, about 2.3 milliseconds amount of current so 2.3 amps current so let's run it so first check uh, over here that amount um, the current is about 2.3 2.24 something and let's now check over here so the amount of voltages that we are um, getting in here is 221 which is approximately equal to 2.20 to sorry, 220 and the amount of current is 2.23 amps and the amount of power and the, as the power factor is 1 so the amount of uh, active power is 0 0.49 and the um, apparent power is also 0 0.49 and the frequency is 50 hertz so now let's change the values and see how it works so now let's set one milliseconds delay this will affect our power factor okay so here it is as the power factor has dropped a little around about 0 0.95 from one so the uh, active power is also dropped now let's further change it Two milliseconds. Okay. Again, the power factor is dropped, zero point eight one, and the active power is also dropped. Now let's keep changing it. Now make it three. Okay, almost the power factor has been dropped to 0 0.58 and the amount of also also has been dropped active power. Okay, now let's further decrease it. Now make it about 4.5. At this nearly zero amount of power will be delivered. Okay, so the power factor has been gone dropped to 0 0.16 T and the active power is 0 and the mo um, maximum amount of power is being used as a reactive power. So this is how we are measuring in our a AC powers. So um, this is one of the simplest technique that you can use to measure the um, power factor and you can design a energy meter. So in this circuits it's a very simple circuit that you can use so all the all thing that has been done over here is just to convert the signals into lower values then apply the filter and after that applying the filter you can uh, you need to measure the power factors and then after you so this is basically convert your sine wave into a square wave same things done over here and after that you are basically comparing the both of the signals and getting that pulse which is different from both of these and after that you are just applying over here so from there you are basically measuring the power factor and this is the relay circuits that in case if the voltage and the currents drop below of other level so you can stop the circuit so if you want the files for this uh, please like share and subscribe my channel and if you want files 
you can send